Ronald, uh, you're going up against Sam Allardyce, to beat him a couple of times as you manager. What are you expecting from him this weekend? No, I, uh, I'm expecting a difficult game because uh, it's always after a big defeat, it's always a reaction. They play home. They have the, 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 the confidence. The last home game, they won 3-0 against Newcastle. And they need points, they need points. And it's always difficult, but if we play our level, we can make it very difficult for them. And then it's all about and they start with a total confidence in the team, but if you score, if you dominate the game, it's also possible that they felt back and maybe they start to be nervous and, and maybe the crowd is unhappy. And that's up to us how we deal and we start the game this Saturday. If you play at your best level and they do sort of the crowd get behind them, they get nervous. Is there another chance of an eight nil? Do you think? No, 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 no. That that happened one one time. That's not that's not a normal result. But I don't think so that we have that luck that we have it that day at at home. I think uh, they had two three players scoring own goals. But that's not normal. That's not normal. Um, you most people are very happy with the away from Ronald, but you didn't sound like you were entirely satisfied yourself, saying sort of we need need to win. How, what was your take on it then? That, that actually you need to turn more of these into three points. Yes, but it's a little bit about that it was a long time ago that we won away, and the draw against Watford, the draw, the nil nil against uh, West Brom, I think. Um, we didn't play good enough, we didn't create enough and, and it's not like, oh, we don't, we don't lose, I'm happy. No, no, it's not always about the result. I, I uh, like to be honest, I, I look to my, to my team, I look to my players and, and we didn't play an, at our level offensive-wise and, and defensively. We are strong, it's difficult to, to score against Southampton, but we can play better than we did against Watford and also against West Brom. What's the, what's the missing link, do you think, then? What's, what's been the difference, the, the fine difference between sort of turning a draw into a win or away from home for your team this year? Oh, I think uh, to be more sharper in the box, uh, really uh, to create out of a lot of ball possession and that's 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 the key to to score goals and to win the game um just uh you, you talked about shay uh shane sorry jay whereabouts is is he in the in uh, still right? painful and then i think maybe it's it's better for to give an update it's it's all about his feet and and, and he's still struggling with pain and and, and He's not totally free to do the, the training session with the team and uh, okay, we don't take that risk now because it's all about uh, the international duty and, and, and normally he's back when we play home uh, against Stoke. I think it's the next. While well, we're talking about injuries, um, Fraser Forster, where's he at? I mean, ah, he's doing very good. He's, he's everything, uh, the plan, what we have, he's... he's He's fast. I don't say that he is, will be back in, in four weeks, but, but it's going good. He's not, he has now four days off. He worked very hard. He's already starting uh, doing training session with Dave Watson. And that's really goalkeeper sessions. And that, that means that, that everybody's happy how he is recovering. And we know it's a long time and he get time to to recover the hundred percent, but uh, he will come back. You're looking forward to having him back. I know Martin Steckenberg's done well in goal, but for yeah, example, number one, isn't it? I like to have all the players available because 
maybe on one side uh, the decisions are more difficult but you have more options and, and Fraser is a great goalkeeper uh, we need it tomorrow and not in two weeks for example we need everybody everybody we need everybody we have a good team we have a good squad and we need everybody to we know about the top season what 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 the Premier League is you said four weeks a minute ago is that sort of the time frame about a month's time you think you'll be back in no 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 I think maybe in in in, in he can be part of the, the group maybe in four or five weeks but uh, he's coming back from April it's a long time and uh, and of course he needs uh, continued training and, and of course he first game will will he play with the under 21s and, and after that long time it's everybody like goalkeepers defenders midfielders ever after that long time they 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 start playing for the under 21